Hey, what up guys, it's Brandon here, and today I'm going to just let y'all know um, what has been, like, my thoughts about, if you guys didn't see the Nintendo Direct, basically, I, um, <clears throat> basically, we had Nintendo Direct on Wednesday, the day I did the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate first episode. If you guys didn't see that, um, you guys could go check it out. So, um, it, it, I mean, it turned out, the episode turned out pretty bad at first with the first episode, but... Eventually, because because of my Wi-Fi on my Switch for some reason, but then eventually actually started working better again. So I managed to not have any problems for like the last match of the episode. But today I just want to go and talk about um the Nintendo Direct that we just had on Wednesday, and I'm I'm, I'm just gonna review just a few major games that were revealed. So um, but uh, yeah, because today I I didn't really know what video to do today. Until I, I saw the, I noticed the direct and I was like, hmm, I'm going to go and just, I'm just going to share my thoughts about this today. I was going to do it yesterday, but I just, re I just remember, remembered that I don't have to, I don't know what video to do today. So I was like, yeah, I'm going to just do it today. But let's just get the start here. We got like, oh, I'm just going to review the um, major games here, um, such as we got, first of all, we got the Link's Awakening remake. So the Link's, the Link's Awakening remake though, um... I mean, it's not bad though. It's actually very good. Well, it's, it shouldn't be bad. It's it. That's a classic. That's a really good um Zelda game. It's the first portable Zelda game ever. Link's Awakening, the original game. And then um five years later, after the original game was released, we had the DX version that came out. I think around I think it was before Ocarina of Time came out. I don't know, but like it came out on the Game Boy Color for a direct like the director's cut, almost like um Sonic Adventure. For the Dreamcast and um, the DX version on the GameCube right here. <laughs> Just want to show you guys that because that's my favorite game. If no one knows that, but I'm pretty sure most of you should know that by now. But um, yeah. So Link's Awakening though, the remake is really good. They actually like um, because if you guys didn't know the the Link the Link's Awakening the original game had the um, they like they like snuck in um like Mario enemies like Mario look like enemies or something i don't know like they had chain chomps goombas or whichever maybe thwomps as well i think i don't know they, they just had like these mario enemies in the game and it was it was crazy though but um they pretty much brought those back in the remake and they made them actually look exactly like the mario enemies because in um in link's awakening the original game it was not really they didn't really look like how they're how they would normally look so I don't know. Like I think Goombas didn't even have their sharp teeth. They just they just smiled or whatever. It was just a, it was just a mouth, no teeth or nothing. It, it just I don't know. But like it, it looked like it looked like um knockoff Mario enemies or something. I don't know. So, but I just wanted to let y'all know that that um we have the new game there. Well, I didn't even let you guys know my thoughts about it. But um well yeah I, I did. I, I said it's not bad. I, I don't I don't think it's bad. I I'm actually pretty excited about the game. And I can't wait to get it when the game comes out, which I don't know when it'll come out, but um, I'm definitely excited for that. So, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. And um, it's basically, because you guys, I don't know if you guys know this, but like we have Oracle of Ages and Oracle of Seasons that came out um, two years after, I think, no, maybe three years, three years after um, the, the DX version of uh, yeah, Link's Awakening came out. And they're ba it's basically like the same graphics and stuff for Oracle of Ages and Seasons. It's almost like a Pokemon. I don't know. I guess I guess you could say it's like almost like a Pokemon game, like Pokemon Red and Blue. I guess it's similar to that, like Oracle of Ages and Seasons. It's literally a Zelda playthrough that we're still doing on the Let's Play squad. Me and Tyler. I'm doing Oracle of Seasons. He's doing Oracle of Ages. We've been doing it for almost a year now, so because we've been pretty much slacking, like throughout the throughout 2018. But that's all right though. Um, but yeah, I just want to let y'all know that my thoughts about Link's Awakening. So far, there's nothing too exciting a little bit, but I, I am, I am excited about it though. The graphics are good. They're definitely good. And, um, they did make, they made Link look like, look just really, um, chibi looking. I don't know. <laughs> Something like that. So, but, um, yeah, just my thoughts about the Link's Awakening. Um, it's really good though. So far, like with the, with the, um, graphic improvement, like with the graphics and, Improving in the graphics basically So I'll let y'all know more details about the game later on but um next up I want to go talk about the Super Mario Maker 2 you guys know I have the first one 
on the Wii U, and I have the I have the 3DS version. I'm not gonna take that out right now, though. I'm not gonna show you all that, but like, well, because I, I don't know, I, I didn't want to really mess up all my games and stuff. That's why I didn't want to take out the 3DS version. I mean, you guys, you guys already know anyway. You guys already know I have that game and the Wii U version. So, but um, we have Super Mario Maker 2, which basically has more stuff now, which I've, which is really um. I was really hoping for some more stuff in the game because when I first, I don't know, I mean, in in the original Super Mario Maker, I was like, and I'm still like that today. I was like, huh, man, there, there's not enough stuff. There's not enough stuff in the game. Like, I, I wish there were like desert levels or something, something like that, or like slopes that they added. It's it's cool that they added the slopes in the game though. Now in the second Super Mario Maker, not only that though, I think you could play as other characters. I think you could play as Luigi. Um, Toadette and Toad, it showed, I think it showed, like, on the title screen or something, on the original. And you guys saw there was, like, a, there was, like, a, um, you know, we have Construction Mario. And now we have Construction, like, there's also Construction, uh, Luigi and his, con yeah, his, uh, with the, with the, um, hard helmet and, you know, what Mario wears. So, there. But, um, yeah, so overall though, I'm def that's what I'm the most excited for though. I'm I'm the most excited for Super Mario Maker 2. And when that game comes out, which is going to be in June, I will be um I'm going to be uh, done with uh Super Mario Maker on the Wii U and then I'm going to be moving on to Super Mario Maker 2. Wow. It's crazy. I'm just abandoning all that series. Like I first first of all, back in 2017, I abandoned Mario Kart on Mario Kart 8 for the Wii U and switched to Mario Kart Deluxe for Mario Kart Online. You guys know recently I just I stopped doing Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, which is with one on one and free for alls, and I just decided to go do and uh do Super Smash Bros. Ultimate online, so which I did which I pretty much started two days ago. So, um and now it's gonna be Mario Maker. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be quitting the Wii U version and I'm gonna be moving on. Well the first I can just say the first, um, Mario Maker, but like I can move from that to the second game. To yeah, the second game. Which is going to be lots of fun. Can't wait for that. But, um, yeah, so we'll see what happens. But, like, not only we have more, I think we have, like, more characters and stuff. I think that's what's going to be happening. But, um, we got more enemies. And most of the game is going to be based off of Super Mario 3D World. So, if you guys remember that game, I'll show you this. I'll show you it. i never done a playthrough on it, but, um, maybe you guys could let me, do you guys think I should do a playthrough on it? Just let me know in the comments below or something if you guys think I should. Because I've, I've not decided yet. I've never I've never really gotten around to the game. Except I showed you guys. I don't know. For those longtime fans. For the for you guys. For the fans that have been like subscribed to my channel for, for like a really long time. Since day one. You guys. I'm pretty sure you guys remember Super Mario 3D World speed runs. I did way back in 2014. So. I don't know. I just wanted to. I just wanted to let, mention that since I. Since I haven't I haven't done Super Mario 3D World speedruns in forever, it used it used to be like one of my earliest se series along with Mario Kart Online when I started that. When I started Mario Kart Online, I also started Super Mario 3D World speedruns, and it, I only did like three episodes within two months, and I just I was just done with it. So, but um yeah, basically the game is gonna be based off it's gonna be like Super Mario 3D World in 2D, and you get the cat suit, which is really cool, which I can't wait to. I can't wait to see all that. And then we got these prana plants, which I don't know if I could, I don't know if you guys could see it on here. I'll, I'll see if, if it does show it. Let me check real quick. Probably not though. I can't really, there's supposed to be these prana plants that, um, I don't know. There's, it's like these prana plants that have like spikes on them and whatnot, like spikes, spikes for their stems or something like around their stem thing. I don't know. But like it's these, it, it's just these types of prana plants that would like, um, that would like just go move, move up or move around and all that. Like instead of like, like really, they're like these really long prana plants. I don't know. Like it's hard to explain. But they they first appeared in uh, Super Mario Three D World, and there's gonna be like all these enemies. Heck, there's even gonna be Boom Boom. Wait, Boom Boom. Yeah, there's gonna be Boom Boom from you guys remember him from New Super. He's from New Super Bros. U. And Super Mario 3, Super Mario Bros. 3, and he um he returned in uh, Super Mario 3D Land and 3D World. So, you you he's in the game as well in Super Mario Maker 2. Pretty much almost everything from Super Mario 3D World is in in um 
Super Mario Maker 2. And there's also snake blocks, which you can actually like make a sequence of their movement. Like when you're when you're when you're creating a level, you can make like a sequence of how they how they move or where they move, and you can actually just do that. It's it's pretty cool though. I can't wait to I cannot wait to try that out. It's, it's oh, man, I'm I'm just excited. That's that's what I'm the most excited for though. Man, I just can't wait for Mario Maker two. You, you guys already know, all right? Just stay tuned for that, and I will um I will let you all know more details about the game when they uh when they reveal more about the game eventually. So um. Maybe I'll do a reaction video on um, on the updates and stuff on, about the game. And Link's Awakening as well, the remake. So, I can't wait for all those two games the most. But um, there were some other games I didn't really care about. I never even watched the Direct anyway, though. Just to let y'all know, I never watched the Direct, but I noticed about the games. So, plus I see memes about it a lot, and I just, you know, I hear people talking about it nonstop. So, yeah, so I'm definitely excited about that. Um... But yeah, Super Mario Maker 2, totally hyped for that. Link's Awakening remake, I'm definitely hyped for that as well, but not as hyped as Super Mario Maker 2 though. But they're all they're both gonna be really good. I can't wait to actually play them. I can't wait to get them. I can't wait to just see how they are. It's just it's just gonna be awesome. And I can't wait to do um show you guys Super Mario Maker 2 when I um switch to that game in my Super Mario Maker Online series. Um I guess I'm just going to mention one last game. I never really saw a trailer or nothing about it. But it's this Tetris 99. Which is apparently it's like a it's like a Fortnite version of uh, Tetris. I don't know. That, that's just cuckoo. But like. Yeah so it's like a Tetris Battle Royale or something like that. Like it's trying. They're really trying to make it like Fortnite. But it's Tetris. Like. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I'm just like. I'm already fed up with all that Fortnite. Fortnite stuff and all that. Fortnite. We have this. Uh, Apex, Apex, I forget what the, I forget what the full title was called, but, um, and we used to have PUBG as well, like all those Battle Royale games. I mean, they're, they're good, they're good though, but like, eh, I don't really care for them that much. That's all. That, that's just my opinion though, but you guys probably think it's, it's definitely awesome, but to me, I just don't really care about Battle Royale games like that. The only time I think of Battle Royale, or the only time I would just play like, just battles and stuff like that. If it's like Mario Party or something, like um, there was this mode called Battle Royale in Mario Party DS. Now that now that's my Battle Royale right there, or maybe some Call of Duty, you know, because I, I I sometimes play Call of Duty as well. But um, yeah, we're already twelve, almost thirteen minutes in, so I'm gonna just end this off here for you guys, to not just to make sure, just to not make this video too long for you guys, but just want to let y'all know my thoughts about the two games, well, three games, uh, Mario Maker, yeah, Mario Maker Two. Link's Awakening, the remake of that, and it's gonna, they're, they're all gonna be on Switch, I think all games are gonna be on Switch though, but, and, uh, we had Tetris 99, it's called, yeah, it's called Tetris 99, I don't know why, I don't know what's with the title with 99, like, I don't know, I, I don't really know that much, but they could just call it Tetris Battle Royale or something, but, pe that's what people usually call it, apparently, but, I don't know why it's called Tetris 99, I don't know, I never saw the trailer, so that's why I'm not really, like, I'm confused about that. I never even seen how the game, the gameplay is or whatever. But I just heard people mentioning about it, that's a, it's a battle royale. That's all I know about it. So I might watch the, um, I might watch the trailer like later on. But for now though, that's basically. It. I'm gonna end this off here for you guys. So uh, I, I just wanna just you know share my thoughts. All right, share my thoughts about the direct and those three games I just mentioned. And I'm I'm definitely excited about um well. Eh, I don't really, I'm, I don't really care about Tetris 99. I just wanted to mention it to you guys, but mostly Mario Maker 2 and Link's Awakening remake. I'm excited about those. So for now, I will see y'all next time, guys. Um, I don't know if there will be a video this weekend, but um, I just got home from school. By the way, it's pretty warm outside right now, so a little bit. It's like it's like 57 degrees, so it's like another warm winter day. But I'm not doing another warm winter vlog. I'm uh, no, nah, you guys, I already did that. All right, that's the only time I'm doing that warm, warm winter vlog, which was was it this past week? No, wait, it was it was last week, right? What day is it? Oh, it's the fifteenth. So last week was the I think I did it on the four fifth. I think I don't know. I can't remember, but it was last week. So other than that, I will see y'all next time, guys. And uh, Monday, I will be doing some more Super Mario Maker Online on the original, the first, the first game still, because the 
you know, Super Mario Maker 2 doesn't release, it doesn't release, um, yet, obviously, it releases all the way in June, so, well, that's like four months away, I could wait, I don't know when Link's Awakening Remake's gonna come out, but I, I can't wait for that game, though, and, um, Tetris 99, I think that game's already out, so it just, it just released, I think, a day after the Direct happened, so, but other than that, though, I will see y'all next time, guys. Be sure to subscribe, like my videos, and if you enjoyed this vlog, and if you guys are excited about these games that I just mentioned, be sure to hit that like button. Yeah, be sure to hit that like button down below, and I will see y'all next time, guys. Yeah, wait, I, I don't know. I, I did this, and I was like, that didn't look like what I usually would do. I meant to say, like, I will like use my hand gesture like this. I will see y'all next time, guys. Thank you guys for watching.